welcome back. Bit of everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. It's the International Cup, EG Cup 2. Um, I've got 201 hours to qualify. The final's going to be in January from the 5th to the 9th. But the qualifiers are on now. It's standard gear only and fixed club skill, which is great. Uh, 18 holes regular on Alpina Forest with normal cups and strong wind. You're only allowed to enter it once, so if you do enter, you've got to get it right. So we're going to go for it. And I'm going to going to show you what happens. So, character progression-wise, you're maxed out on club skill, by the looks of it. Um, yeah, so all your clubs are maxed out. You're allowed just the standard clubs, just the standard ball. You've got 14 P-shots. Um... Yeah, let's go for it. Time to begin. Time to move. So the first one, you didn't get much club skill at all, um, and you were quite down on power, which kind of made for an interesting contest because I'd not played. It was Eagle City. I'd not played Eagle City like that in a long time. Um, I'm kind of used to hitting it 360, 370, to be hitting it 260. You kind of got to remember how to play that course. So Alpina Forest, we're hitting it at about 280. So again, whilst they've maxed the clubs up, they're not. You know, you're on the standard club. You don't add your custom club with all that extra power. So this should be a pretty fair contest. Um, again, lots of control on the clubs, which will be good because that'll stop the sway. So accuracy, I think, will be easier to achieve. I think than with the other the other clubs. And again, no special balls, so. No kind of picking your poison. Either an Alpina Forest. I'm not sure which ball really helps. So here we go. Qualifier. Best score's 15 under so far. But I'd expect... I'd be expecting people coming around in 18, 19, 20s. I do wonder what the cut will be for this. What will the cut be? Okay, so par 4 to start. Fair bit of headwind, so let's get it. Let's get it down there. Obviously, using the power shot. Oh, nice shot. We want to stay out of those bunkers of a can. Yeah, that's nice and safe. Should give us a good shot into the pin. Pins up at the back. Again, we'll be into the wind. Fifty-three to go, so we get the approach. Bit of wind. Again, no um, no um, tornado cups to help us. Oh, that's not bad. A little bit too much club. I underread the wind, overread the wind. Okay, do I want to go for the chip in here? I'm going to have to hit it. I'm going to have to hit the pimp. Yeah, there we go. It's a chip in birdie. So I've got 15 under for this course as a round, which would be on par with the best score, but obviously I've scored higher on individual holes. It's a par three. It's a par three. Fair bit of wind. It's coming across us and forward, so seven iron. Maybe a little bit more club. Maybe a little bit more club. Let's just hit past the hole. Masterful. Well, wow, yeah, the wind's got much more left to right on it than I imagined. Really off target there. Really pushed it. So 12 and a half to go. It's going to drop right when it lands. Yeah, that wasn't great. Spin back. Go on, go on, go on, go on, drop. Yes. That needed a bit of luck and it got it. <laughs> so two chipping birdies to start. I need to start reading this wind. I need to start reading this wind. Okay, par five. So, fair bit of wind into us again. But again, on the woods, it has much less impact. Let's play for about there. Power shots on. Hit the impact. Wind should just bend it round. Again, how far you can get up just because of the altitude is restricted. 
So 150 to go. Heck of a lot of wind. And again, I'm on an iron this time, so it is gonna it is gonna carry it. It's gonna need more than that. Let's try back of the green for pace. Wow, the wind really moves it. Really moves it. Look at that. So I was off the green to the right, and I ended up off the green to the left. Which is crazy, isn't it? It's just crazy. Okay. Let's see if we can get it out the bunker. Well, oh, that's not bad considering. So I got myself within four foot. Chance for a birdie. Which, considering I was in the sand, I will gratefully take. So scrambling around, I got three birdie. Oh, that's my best. Yeah, so at the start, my best score was 15 under. That wasn't the best score for the tournament. That uh, makes sense. Okay, right. Heck of a lot of wind here. So where do I want to set up? Where do I want to set up? Now, in the past, I've absolutely gone for these. Try to get the water skip. I'm not sure I've got the length for the water skip today, but I've probably got a length for something along the lines down here. Let's give it a go. Suzuki likes it, so we're getting a kick somewhere. Wow, that's bent so far. Got the water skip that I wasn't going for. Wow, the wind moves those balls. So we're in the rough. 40 yards to go. Enormous amount of wind again. We've been here before. It is going to kick left a bit. Am I going to lose a little bit on the, because of the ground? Oh, fluffed it. What's the wind going to do? Yeah, it didn't bring us back enough. Well, we've got a putt. We've got a putt. Okay. So it's going to break right. The break eases off. It's going to ease off, though. Okay, maybe about there. How's that one looking? Go on. Yeah. Oh. Scrambling around for our birdies. It's a powerful. Okay, so we're a little bit downwind here. Probably haven't got the length to clear it. So let's go here. Yeah. Wind's going to bring it back. That's okay. Middle of the fairway. So it leaves us 105. Again, a lot of wind. A lot of wind. And we're going to float it up there as well, which doesn't help. Yeah, good shot. Wow, oh, the wind just pulls it so far. So again, we're scrambling round. Okay. Need to hit the pimp. Another chipping birdie. Well, that's three chipping so far. <laughs> I can't keep this luck up, can I? It's a powerful. I gotta read the wind better. That's the solution to this problem. Okay, so crosswind. Well, I'm going to have to cut a tree in the way, so I'm going to have to stand this up somehow. Okay. So let's try and let's try and fade it round the tree. Go! Masterful. Right, that wind's got hold of it. Wow, that wind. That is something else, that wind. Luckily, the slopes come to my rescue a little bit there. So we're on the fairway. Fairways have been alright, it's been the greens. So, 141, 128 to go, sorry. Again, you know, I almost want to hit it there. Which is ridiculous. It's a ridiculous place to hit the ball. Crikey, again. That's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. 
I take that all day long. So, nice easy birdie pup. So that's the first one really I haven't been scrambling round. Oh, you're good. So that was a better help. Is a par three. Okay, seventh hole, par three. Eight iron again. Bucket to wind. Bucket to wind. There's no margin for error there at all, is there? So let's learn the lesson of the last time. Oh, good shot. Oh, line's not bad. Line's not bad. Line's not bad. Yeah, just didn't come back enough. But again, there was no margin there at all. Now, nah, Birdie's at risk here. Birdie's really at risk here. Okay. Need to hit the pin. Oh! So that's our first par. We're a foot away, mind you. Uh, I mean, with all those chippings, though, it was inevitable. It was absolutely inevitable. Okay. It's a powerful. Oh, I do not like this hole. So, I've played this hole many, many times. Basically, anywhere right of that marker, you just go down into the water. So you've got to keep it left. But there's no way I can drive that if I'm realistic. Uh, again, the wind might help me out here. So maybe we do. Maybe we just play it up there. If we get it up onto that upper tier. And then we'll have a decent approach in. Come on. Oh, need It's got to get onto the upper tier. Got to get onto the upper tier. Got to get onto the upper tier. Stay. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. It's a 40 yarder. That's a little bit of in the saddle of the green. So either side it's going to roll away. There's a bit of wind, but not a lot of wind. It's the shortest approach. It is going to kick left a tiny bit. Okay. Probably over pitched it, but that's probably not a bad thing. Ooh. Oh, actually, spot on, spot on. Go for the birdie. It's a three foot flat as you like for a birdie. I'll take it. Birdie. Oof, this is hard work. Oh, my. It's, a five. it's a nine, massively downhill, but that wind. That win there. Okay. So we'll shape it. Give it a bit of fade. With a bit of luck, that should keep us. Wow, that's gone right. That's gone right. Maybe the slope will help us out. There you go. It's beaten my best drive. 210 to go. Okay, so we're still a little bit downhill. And we're going to shape this in as well. Didn't get the impact. Chance of the water. Chance of the water. Chance of the water. No, we're all right. 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 Sand. I'll take the sand. I'll take the sand. Okay. So a little bit into the wind. It's going to kick a little bit left. And lose a bit of power. Actually, if we can get it close. That's alright, that's alright. So, birdie pup. Let's just go just outside the right hand edge. Hit it firm. With a bit of luck, that'll just break and drop. There you go. Oh. So, eight under for the outward nine. I think I'll take it. I think I'll take it. I mean, there was a. Early on, we were really struggling to read those. Um, to read that wind. And those three chippings absolutely saved my bacon. But we've got better. We're, we're getting, you know, getting our approaches much closer. So, inward nine. Tenth hole. Again, lots of altitude here. Lots of altitude. Now, actually, do I want... I probably want to drop it on there, if I'm honest. So, let's go up here. Let's hit it about there. And with a bit of luck, we'll end up where we want to be. Like we do not want to be on the right-hand side. Come on! Oh, good shot. Yeah, wind's going to bring it back. That could be alright. It's just going to run up into the rough, I think. 
Look at the gauge closely. Okay, so it's going to kick right, but that's probably not bad because it wants to bring it back left. I might turn the approach off because I need the altitude here. The wind's going to bring that way left. Well, that's okay. That's okay. So it gives us a 12 footer for our birding. It's breaking reasonably to evenly to the left. And then it's flat, so I can I can be bold with it. Let's try them out there. Break, 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 break. Oh, just, just about. Needed a touch more power there just to calm my nerves. So birdie start, which is good. Okay, par three. Proper crosswind. Proper crosswind. I mean, we're around there, aren't we, if we're honest. Okay, so we probably overread that. That was probably eight metres worth of wind. Left ourselves a really tricky par pub. Breaks to the left. So it breaks much more in the first half than the second. And I've got to be gentle with it. I can't hit this. Hard, or it'll run miles. Go on. Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Oh. That was a that was a good attempt. I'm I'm reasonably happy with that as an attempt. If I missed it, I missed it, but I'll take the attempt. The failing there was the um was the first shot. Had I put that inside twelve foot, I think that's makeable. Ah, it's balloons. Five. Ah, Alpina 12. I mean, that, that, the, the cut's not on today for sure. Absolutely not on today. Uh, yeah, if those of you haven't seen custom clubs, you can get up there. Um, how much can we How much can we take off today? Oh, missed the impact. Missed the impact. Where's that going to go? Suzuki's quiet. Oh, I've got away with that. That bent enough that the wind straightened it up perversely. Look how straight that is, considering that wind. So that was such an extreme slice that the wind caught it. Wow, so I've got a break there. Okay. The wind's going to take a bit of distance off this, but we're way down now. That's a four iron. Let's have a go. Where's that going to go? Oh, tree caught it. That's not bad. So five footer for an eagle. I was not expecting five foot for an eagle. So let's go about half a cup. About a third of a cup outside the left edge. And we'll hit it firm. It'll break a bit, but hopefully not tons. Yeah, just in the left edge. Oh, there you go. That's a much needed eagle. you're good. Much needed eagle. Is a par three. Another par three. Again, how much wind do I read? Maybe that much. Now, this one's uphill as well. So we've got to hit past it. Oh, let's just go so far right. Yeah, line. Just didn't read the line. Pace was a bit short. Okay, so pretty even break. It's flat, so I can hit it relatively firmly. Hopefully it will hold its line. And then drop in. Yeah, great. Like it. Okay, 14. So it's another downhill. Well, that's probably reachable. The question is about how much is this wind going to play into it? How much how much across is the wind going to... How far across is the wind going to push you? Uh, probably overhit that. This is all about where it bounces. But a very high pitch. Yeah, it's just run on too far. So, 18 foot putt back. Don't let the eagle slip. 
That's a pretty nice steady. It's a steady break, isn't it? And I can hit it firm. About there. Yes. Go on. Yeah. Nice eagle. Oh, another eagle. Oh, you're good. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Hole fifteen. It's a par four. It's a fifteen downhill again. Oh, that water, you know, that sand's in play for sure. Right, in the, right where you would land it. I mean, part of me says lay up. Part of me says lay it up here. And just take that sand out of play. That's what part of me says. Bravo. And I've listened to the sensible bit of me. <sighs> Oh, no, have I put that in anyway? It's just going to hold up, hopefully. Yeah, okay. So, 112 to go. Heck of a lot of wind. And it's in our face. We need a bit more club. Let's see if we can stand it up in the wind. It's a bit of hook on it to hold it up. Oh, that's quite nice. I'll take a six footer. It's a six foot for the birdie. Sloping uphill. About a third of cup outside, I think. And then we'll hit it firm. Yeah. It's a fifteen under, but in all right. Sixteen. It's a par four. Again, the wind. Now I've skipped this before. So with that wind, I'm going to play it there. And if it does drift left, yeah. oh, good shot. we should get the water skip. Go on, go on, go on. Water. Ah! Rubbish. So that was that was a mistake. That was a mistake. Okay. Ah! Fluff, they got a flyer. We're in trouble here. We're in trouble here. We are in trouble. Don't take your eye off the gate. So this is for par. And that's the bit, isn't it, I suppose? It's a tough putt for bogey. Breaks to the left. Ah, uh, back to 14. I Means 16's possible, but we were on for 18 under. 17. It's a powerful. Okay. So concentrate. Go! Bravo! I need to avoid. Ah, uh, hit the tree. That'll drop it short. That's okay. That's okay. Okay, we need the chip in here if we're honest. So it's going to kick a bit right, the wind's going to bring it back to left, and it wants to drop right. Mm, probably about there. Ooh, <laughs> Too far left. But, nice safe birdie pup. One old to go. It's a 15 under. I've albatross this hole in the past, haven't I? It's a par five. I went down the right, I think. I went down this. Yeah, I went over here. Which I've got the length for today. We'll, we'll play down here. Right to the teeth of the gale as well. Good impact. Great shot. It's a 287, 252 to go. Okay, fair bit of wind. Sort of reachable. I can hopefully get it up and about and give myself a good birdie shot at least. Oh, I might be in the sand. I think the tree saved me from the sand. I just kept going, that's weird. 
So, 57 foot. Okay. Can we get it close enough to give ourselves a good pop? Ooh. Oh, we can, it turns out. It's a 5 foot for 16 under. Will that make the cut? I don't know. Could have got 18. If the cut ends up at 18, I'd be annoyed, but... I don't know, 16's a good round. It's a good round. Struggled really early on. It was that mistake on 16 with the water. I think I'm happy. I think that represents my golf. Yeah, so I'm not going to live for a couple of days if I've qualified there. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I think you should have a go at the, the EG Cup. They're quite good fun. They're a real proper test of your golf. Yeah. Um, please like, share and subscribe and come back and hopefully I'll make the cut and we'll, we'll play the final.